Deke has some exciting news to share. Hello, Deke. Professor Weasley said you had an idea. Indeed, Deke does. Uh, uh, Deke knows that you want to learn about all sorts of beasts. And Deke recently heard rumors of a phoenix nest in a nearby mountain. A phoenix nest? I wonder if it belongs to the phoenix Natty mentioned, the one Harlow and the poacher pack are after. Deke would not doubt it. If Deke has heard of it, surely the nasty poachers have as well, which means it could be in danger. Well, I'd better go and rescue it then, hadn't I? Deke thinks so. So majestic a beast should not fall into such vile hands. Deke is not sure why, but Deke feels that saving a phoenix might help to make amends for what happened with Deke's prior master. Deke hopes that you are able to find the phoenix and bring it to the room where it will be safe. and it's simply ludicrous that I've been defied at every turn. Blockade. Rookwood's poachers are already here. Revelio. Being there, good for you. Oh. 
Safer now. Good bring them. I found a deer called Den. It seems as if it wants me to follow it. I need to find it before the poachers do. Hamora. You're so foul. Bombarder. 
Bombarda. Take you somewhere safe. Let's get you back to the room. Deke's going to be pleased. I should investigate. Did you find the phoenix? Yes, Deke. And I rescued it from the poachers. I have it here. It's safe. Remarkable. Well, what are you waiting for? Deke cannot wait to... You keep it close. Professor Weasley and Deke were right to tell you about the Room of Requirement. Look at all you've done, and how many beasts you've rescued. A phoenix is safe now, because of you. I couldn't have done it without your help, Deke. Thank you. Uh, Deke is grateful for the kind words, and also grateful to have been of assistance to someone like yourself. Helping you do such good for so many beasts has given Deke a sense of peace Deke hasn't known in years. Deke will always be here for you when you need him. <laughs> 